Scientists at Indiana University have created a highly efficient biomaterial that catalyzes the formation of hydrogen one half of the holy grail of splitting H2O to make hydrogen and oxygen for fueling cheap and efficient cars that run on water. A modified enzyme that gains strength from being protected within the protein shell or capsid of a bacterial virus, this new material is 150 times more efficient than the unaltered form of the enzyme. The process of creating the material was recently reported in Self-Assembling Biomolecular Catalysts for Hydrogen Production in the journal Nature Chemistry. Essentially, we've taken a virus's ability to self-assemble myriad genetic building blocks and incorporated a very fragile and sensitive enzyme with the remarkable property of taking in protons and spitting out hydrogen gas, said Trevor Douglas the Earl Blau Professor of Chemistry in the IU Bloomington College of Arts and Sciences Department of Chemistry, who led the study. The end result is a virus-like particle that behaves the same as a highly sophisticated material that catalyzes the production of hydrogen. Other IU scientists who contributed to the research were Megan C. Thielgs, an assistant professor of chemistry, Ethan J. Edwards, a PhD student, and Paul C. Jordan, a postdoctoral researcher at Alios Biopharma, who was an IU PhD student at the time of the study. The genetic material used to create the enzyme, hydrogenase, is produced by two genes from the common bacteria Escherichia coli, inserted inside the protective capsid using methods previously developed by these IU scientists. The genes, Hia A and Hia B, are two genes in E. coli that encode key subunits of the hydrogenase enzyme. The capsid comes from the bacterial virus known as bacteriophage P22. The material is potentially far less expensive and more environmentally friendly to produce than other materials currently used to create fuel cells. The costly and rare metal platinum, for example, is commonly used to catalyze hydrogen as fuel in products such as high-end concept cars.